morning again guys. Today I've got work at five, but Naomi's got the day off, like I mentioned yesterday. So we're going to the cinema to see Piki too. And the only reason we're going to the cinema in town is because Naomi gets it for free, because she's got a card. And I get it for cheaper, so might as well save some money. So we'll have to see Pika, Pika too. Pika, Pika. Oh, missed that. <laughs> Shiny steps. Okay. Well, the tip to Pikachu was, I bet you Naomi enjoyed it, look how happy she is. <laughs> it was very good, but now we end up having to watch it again because Tom wants to watch it. But I don't mind because it, it's definitely worth watching twice. You know, dinner. Yeah. That's when I can actually see. <laughs> it's so bright. We go that way towards McDonald's, then cut up. Hey guys, I'm off to work. I've just put a milkshake all over the floor. Yeah, like I said, I'm just off to work before I film milkshake. But it's one more class tonight, and then we're done. Nine o'clock tomorrow. And it's slam dunk. So it's really good tonight, I've been done with. And it's been, well, it's been a nice uh, nice day today. I'll spend all day with Naomi and then go off to work. So it's been nice. So I'm not going to see you much now. See you tonight for a bit. When I get back, you should still wait. See you tomorrow for a little bit. All tomorrow night, we're going to finish work. And I'm not going to see you until I get back from slam dunk on Sunday. Probably night. So it is nice to get to see her. I forgot to quickly mention as well, I bought everything for the baby announcement. So we're going to do that on Wednesday once we find out. So let's go ahead and you guys will know by it right now. And things looking up are pretty good as well. Like the next two weeks of shifts are like early, so finishing around about like eight, nine o'clock. So it means I get to see Naomi a lot more. So I'm like, no work all night, finishing at like stupid o'clock in the morning, not even seeing her, just seeing her while she's fast asleep. She's definitely looking up for two weeks. Yeah, man. But for now, get to work, it's final clothes done. Yeah, I'm ready for sleep. Hey guys, we're finally finished work. She's had a great drink after work with everybody. But it's windy and warm. But I had one quick drink after work with everybody. Just because it's been a really stressful day. It's one quick drink. Kind of to celebrate as well that, like, come technically today but tomorrow if you know what I mean I have literally got <coughs> sorry <coughs> so guys technically today tomorrow I've got a two till nine and I'm done it's slum dunk and I really can't wait but for now I'm gonna hurry up and get in see if I've got a jacket on it's absolutely freezing apart from that bit of wind we're really warm Really random with that game, but I'm gonna hurry up. I know because it's quiet, like I said yesterday on the vlog. You can just walk in the middle of the road, but if I don't just leave because now I'm gonna be faster than now, which is the only problem. Is we're finishing late, there was only fast on. It's the only reason I stayed around. Apart from it, it's been a stressful day, so I'd add pint also because. I know Naomi would be fast asleep when I get home, so I'm not going to be able to see her anyway. I'll just see her asleep. So I'll have a drink, be social with everybody, have a little like chat, out of work hours, just socialise. Yeah. I just kind of like celebrating my last clothes before slam dunk. I can't wait. And I've mentioned it so many times, I've mentioned it so many times today as well. It's got a bit ridiculous, people are kind of getting fed up with mentioning it. But, Slam Dunk is literally a day away, and I can't wait. All I'm not looking forward to is getting up at like half past seven to go to Slam Dunk. But for now, I just want to get home. Literally straight in, straight to bed, straight to sleep. Probably get up in about, hopefully, six hours. Uh, to do a seven hour shift. I think it's seven hours? Yeah, seven hour shift. And slam dunk. I'm literally leaving at nine o'clock. I apologise to everyone at work. Normally I'll hang around, help out. But I'm going at nine, get my bag ready, which I'll probably do in the morning. I've already got a pile of slam dunk stuff. Yeah. Leave at nine o'clock, get myself ready. Literally just took everything in this rucksack because, like I said, I've already got a pile of stuff. <laughs> Spend all night with Naomi to then see her for about an hour come Saturday morning. 
I just slam dunk for like a day and a half. Try and get back if we can to see you at dinner. If not, I'll probably see you for like half an hour before I leave for work. Come Sunday night. And then work Sunday, off Monday. Not sure what we've got planned yet, but can't wait. I just can't wait literally to finish at 9 o'clock tomorrow. But for now, I keep literally checking down because I keep hearing noises. I keep looking at like, the screen of the camera just to make sure there's not someone falling or anything like that. It's really creepy walking through town this time. It's like so dead. Any sound is like, why is the people walking around? But yeah, I'm gonna call it a night now because I just want to get in, get some sleep. Get up before Nemo leaves work so I can see her for a bit. Just in case I don't see her at dinner because I started too. She knows where's the dinner between half total. Half like that. Yeah, that freaked me out then. Yeah, she knows where's the dinner between half total and half one. So just in case I don't get to see her because I'd be leaving at half one and her dinner runs late, I want to see her a bit in the morning. So we're getting straight to bed. So thanks again for watching. I'll see you tomorrow, guys.